That should be his house. There are so many Gardamex stationed around the place. Uh, that's pretty unusual, right? According to what he told me last time we spoke, he hired them so he won't be harassed or disturbed. Huh. So there are a lot of flowers in his garden, but... Paimon doesn't think we'll be able to pick one without alerting the Gardamex. Right. Which is exactly why I think there has to be a special connection between him and the killer. So... should we knock? Just wait here for now. I'd like to take care of a number of those Gardamex first. But they're so far away! How are you planning to do that? Don't forget, Paimon. I'm actually the real-life captain of the Musketeers. All clear. Let's go. Wait, wait, wait! Paimon's a little nervous now that we know he could be the killer. <laughs> Can we go over our plan of action again? I'll go knock on the door and make sure it's safe inside. Once we're sure that we're in the clear, I'll ask him to come with us for a quick round of questioning at the guard's headquarters. But can't we just arrest him? We still have no evidence that he's the killer, or that he lent the killer any direct aid. Still, it would be appreciated if you could pick a rainbow rose from his garden for me while I'm talking to him. It'll help the Marashose Phantom confirm Emily's theory. Sure, no problem. Just be careful, Chevras. <laughs> <laughs> 